I'm pleased to welcome you to today's International Dispute Resolution Conference, jointly organized by the United Nations Commission on International Trade Law, the Hong Kong Mediation Center, and the International Dispute Resolution and Risk Management Institute. Today, we have over 800 delegates from all over the world joining this conference in Hong Kong. We gather here to witness the beginning of the new era of global collaboration. But I would be remiss if I did not use this opportunity to highlight the latest developments in ancestral work which serves to enhance international trade and commerce and also to implement the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. International institutions such as the United Nations and the World Trade Organization are actively exploring reforms to the existing trade and investment disputes resolution mechanisms. A good and effective dispute resolution mechanism should help people tell right from wrong and promote peace and development. Hong Kong has great potential not only as an international financial center, but also as a hub for regional and international dispute resolution and as a mediation center at all levels for all users, from the largest multinational corporation to the smallest businessmen. I hope that every participant has fully enjoyed today's conference. For friends and colleagues from overseas, I also wish you a pleasant stay in Hong Kong and a safe journey home. Thank you all very much.